Hello, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Uh, Today's date, it is January 16th of 2015. This is a review of this. Let's see. Anyway, next to me. Automatic pet feeder. This is it in the box. I actually made a uh, made this video before and uh, messed it up. So I'm not before I took it, put it together, put food in it, did all that kind of stuff. I don't know if you can see. My cat did not like that. We have a really sweet cat here and a wonderful cat. But I brought this in my room here and set it up on the desk and I brought the cat food in which we always feed the cat in the kitchen. I brought the cat food in, you know, in the container or whatever, and the cat followed, and uh, I put this thing together, and I filled the, excuse me, uh, filled the the uh, bowl here with, uh, with the cat food, put this together, it kind of locks on there, and uh, our cat saw me doing that, and the cat was looking at me like, uh, are you crazy? What are you doing putting my food? How come I'm not being fed in the kitchen? How come, and why are you putting in this? Then the cat was trying to, you know, looking in the container and like, how come I can't get my food? And uh, also blocking the camera here, so I tried to move the cat, and uh, she did not like that one bit. So I'm making a new video. Um, We have one cat here. My uh, grown daughter, uh, she's 50, I think, lives a few blocks away. I I think she has five cats. She may have more. And uh, she has one of these, I believe. I think she has another from a different manufacturer. And uh, this is, and then my grandson lives across town. He's 27. He has one cat. I think we're going to give him this because he's into video games a lot. And uh, I don't think he wants to be bothered to feed the cat. So we're going to, this is going to go to him. Uh, Anyway, I set it up. Absolutely no trouble uh, setting it up. Um. Let's see here. What else I need to tell you? Has a nice display on it. You know, it does need a. Uh, I'd, I'd kind of like. I'm used to you know fancy color displays and stuff like that. But that's fine. It uh, has all everything you need there, and it's fine. I just like something. You know, I'd like something. I'm into high-tech stuff, always have been. Um, One thing I wanted to mention, and I checked some of the... I hope I'm not coming down with the flu right now. I'm not sure when you're going to be watching this review, but we're having a flu epidemic here in the United States, a a bad one this year, and I didn't get a flu shot. Uh... Anyway, I I checked it out. Everything worked works great. Oh, that yeah. Except for one thing. And that is the uh doing the recording with your voice so that you can say to your cat whatever, you know, time to eat, come and get your food. Uh, whatever, you know, meow, meow, whatever you want to say, you record. The recording quality is horrendous, really bad, really, really bad. Uh, What I intended to check, and I forgot to check, anyway, I checked other reviews, and people said the same thing. What I intended to check, and I didn't get the chance to check, is I wonder if 
uh, when you're doing the recording, if you were to pick this thing up, there's this uh, microphone on it. I guess that's a microphone. It wouldn't be this. I didn't notice where the speaker was. Maybe that's a speaker hole also. Anyway, I wonder if you were to go right up to it, you know, and record that way. I suspect that would make the difference, but I didn't try it. So anyway, be aware. Warning, warning. Uh, the uh, audio is not good. If you find a way uh, to correct it, um, then... Uh, Let's see, we're doing a screen capture, and we've got sun coming in the window here. That isn't good. Not that you need to see me. I might look better if I were blanked out. So anyway, I give this five stars. It's good price. Uh, it's a great idea. Uh, works well, except for the audio. So that looks like the cat that my grandson has uh, anyway thank you very much for uh, thank you very much for watching